Mornings with Mandy. I'm Mandy. I have my coffee and we're gonna do some more FAQs for you today. Is this bike engine good for hills? Well that really depends on the sprocket tooth count that you have. So a good rule of thumb is the lower the teeth on the sprocket, the higher speeds. The higher the teeth on the sprocket, the higher torque. Um, so for like a utility vehicle, if you're hauling stuff, uh, hauling loads with your bike, um, or if you're even just a little bit heavier than most people, um, a, a 48 tooth that we offer on our website with our engine kits is a great option. It's going to have a lot more torque. Um, if you're using your bike as like a racing vehicle, a 36 tooth sprocket would be a good um, option. And I mean, that's what we offer. Uh, I'm not going to recommend you go get an even less tooth count because especially with the Phantom, it's such a powerful engine already. 36 is really all you need to get those speeds. Um, we do offer a 44 tooth as well, which is kind of right in the middle of both of those, which can give you good speed and good torque um, and make it, it's really customizable to what you want it to be used for. So like if it's a workhorse motor bicycle that you're using, a 44 tooth would probably be the best option for you because it's going to give you that speed and it's also going to give you better torque than a 36 tooth would. Thanks for spending some minutes with me. I'm Mandy and have a great rest of your day. I might look like I'm crying, but it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> this is sharpie. <laughs>